one of nine, two of nine. Monday, screening at the Cinematheque of David Lynch's 2001 mix of Hollywood satire, film noir, and fever dream, Mulholland Drive. Monday, Comedy Here often presents a stand-up comedy show at the Hollywood Theater by American comic, actor, and radio host Donald Rawlings. Monday to Friday, new exhibition T, Rex, the ultimate predator reveals the story of the most iconic dinosaur in the world through life-sized models, fossil casts, and engaging interactives. The exhibition runs until January 22, 2023, at Science World. Monday to Friday, The Imitation Game, Visual Culture in the Age of Artificial Intelligence, a new exhibition running at the Vancouver Art Gallery until October 23, surveys the extraordinary uses of AI in the production of modern and contemporary visual culture around the world. Yoko Ono's Growing Freedom exhibition is at the VAG. Monday to Friday, Growing Freedom, the instructions of Yoko Ono slash The Art of John and Yoko runs at the Vancouver Art Gallery until May 1. The exhibition is divided into two parts, the first of which delves into Ono's artistic process, reflecting her radical and unconventional approach, and the second highlighting Ono and her deceased husband John Lennon's collaborative art projects aimed at promoting peace. Monday to Friday, the Vancouver Cherry Blossom Festival, an intercommunity arts and culture outdoor festival, runs until April 23 at various Vancouver locations. Monday to Friday, Rennie Museum presents Spring 2022, Collected Works, a group exhibition on the potency of photography featuring the work of Larry Clark, Katie Grannon, and Andre Serrano, running until May 28. Warning, this exhibition includes images and content that some may find offensive. Monday to Friday, in collaboration with the Winnipeg Art Gallery, the Museum of Vancouver is presenting the traveling exhibition Border X until October. Sapphire Hayes plays the Fox Cabaret. Jan Gates. Tuesday, music on main present Sapphire Hayes, a duo composed of Cindy Cow and Aisha Dulong, at the Fox Cabaret. Tuesday, British experimental rock band Black Midi plays Imperial Vancouver, with guest injury reserve. Tuesday, the Vancouver Canucks take on the Vegas Golden Knights in National Hockey League action at Rogers Arena. Tuesday, Amsterdam psych rock band Alton Gunn plays the Rickshaw Theatre, with guests Packerman. Nightmare Alley, with Bradley Cooper, screens at the Rio Theatre. Tuesday, screening at the Rio Theatre of Guillermo del Toro's modern war thriller, Nightmare Alley, starring Bradley Cooper. Tuesday to Friday, the Arts Club Theatre Company presents Made in Italy, a play about a second-generation Italian teen struggling to find his place in Jasper, Alberta, at the Granville Island stage until April 17. Tuesday to Friday, Kostjuk Gallery presents The Subconscious Voice, a duo exhibition of new artworks by Canadian artists Stu Oxley and Curtis Cutshaw, running until May 1. Tuesday to Friday, Hamlin's Women, running to April 29 at Gabber Gastony Studio, features Gastonese portraits of women in Ethiopia who have had fistula surgery. Sarah ROA plays Alice in Gateway Theatres in Wonderland. Ben Laird. Tuesday to Friday, in Wonderland, a contemporary retelling of Lewis Carroll's Alice's Adventures in Wonderland and Through the Looking Glass runs until April 16 at Richmond's Gateway Theatre. Tuesday to Friday, Canoe Cultures, Hokumel at the Vancouver Maritime Museum features the work of 20 indigenous artists and carvers alongside historical images and information that tells the story of the resilience and strength of indigenous peoples through the war canoe and all it represents. Cured by indigenous artist and cultural historian Roxanne Charles, the exhibition runs until July 3. Tuesday to Friday, Carousel Theatre presents Ladies and Gentlemen, Boys and Girls, the story of a nine-year-old who comes out as a boy to his family, at the Waterfront Theatre. Tuesday to Friday, performances at the Red Gate Review stage of Collected Stories, Donald Margulies' searching look at the lives of a pair of writers, focusing on their friendship and ambition. Steve Dawson plays the Blue Shore Financial Center for the Performing Arts. Wednesday, guitarist, composer, and producer Steve Dawson celebrates the release of his new album Gone, Long Gone, at the Blue Shore Financial Center for the Performing Arts. Wednesday, Swedish post-punk band Viagra Boys plays the Rickshaw Theater, with guests S. Birds. Sold out. Wednesday, Salt Lake City dream pop band Choir Boy plays the Biltmore Cabaret, with guests Ricky and Spectres. Wednesday to Friday, 
Cloud Album, a new exhibition featuring more than 250 historically and culturally significant works drawn from the collection of the London-based Archive of Modern Conflict, runs until May 1 at the Polygon Gallery. Wednesday to Friday, Show Show Esquiro, Doctrine of Discovery is a solo exhibition by designer, artist, and activist Show Show Esquiro that showcases meticulously crafted couture gowns, textiles, paintings, and photographs to celebrate the beauty and resilience of First Nations communities. The exhibition runs at the Bill Reed Gallery of Northwest Coast Art until June 5. Cirque du Soleil's Allegria is under the big top at Concord Pacific Place. Wednesday to Friday, Allegria, a Cirque du Soleil classic reimagined for a new generation, runs until June 5 under the big top at Concord Pacific Place. Thursday, local folk rock duo Hollow Twin plays the Fox Cabaret, with guest Silent St. J and Wesley Atuk. Thursday, the Vancouver Canucks take on the Arizona Coyotes in National Hockey League action at Rogers Arena. Thursday, local indie band Rare Americans plays the Biltmore Cabaret, with guests The Gins. Thursday, Canadian folk pop singer-songwriter and environmental activist Sarah Harmer plays the Vogue Theatre. Bob Mould plays the Rickshaw Theatre. Thursday, former Husker Du member Bob Mould plays the Rickshaw Theatre as part of his Distortion and Blue Hearts tour. Thursday to Friday, performances at Metro Theatre of By Misadventure, in which a television crime series writer resorts to blackmail to keep his partner in line. Running Thursday Sun, until April 28. Thursday to Friday, the Arts Club Theatre Company presents The Kink in My Hair, a musical celebration of women of color, at the Stanley Industrial Alliance stage. Friday, 35th Anniversary Screening at the Rio Theatre of Sam Raimi's Evil 2, starring Bruce Campbell. Friday, American rockers The Brian Jonestown play the Vogue Theatre, with guests Mercury Rev. Stephen Fearing plays Mel Lehan Hall at St. James. Friday, the Rogue Folk Club presents Stephen Fearing, Juno-winning co-founder of Blackie and the Rodeo Kings, at the Mel Lehan Hall at St. James. Friday, Curious Creations Collective presents Waiting for Garbo, a new musical with a social conscience about plastic in the oceans and consumerism, at Presentation House Theatre. Friday, the Pacific Spirit Choir presents performances of Gabriel Forrest Requiem and Antonin Dvorak's Mass in D at West Vancouver United Church. Friday, Atlanta-based rock band Mattiel, fronted by Mattiel Brown, plays the Fortune Sound Club. Friday, American DJ specializing in mashups and digital sampling, Girl Talk, plays the Commodore Ballroom. Sold out.